How to calculate the time period of oscillations and axis of a ring? Question A thin fixed ring of radius 1 meter has a positive charge 1 into 10 raised to the power minus 5 coulomb uniformly distributed over it. A particle of 0 0.9 gram having a negative charge of 1 into 10 raised to the power minus 6 coulomb is placed on the axis at a distance of 1 centimeter from the center of the ring. Show that the motion of the negatively charged particle is approximately simple harmonic. Calculate the time period of oscillations. This question was asked in IIT JEE 1982. Solution In an earlier video, we have studied that the electric field due to a uniformly charged ring of radius R at a point distant x from its center on its axis is given by the relation E equal to KQX divided by x square plus R square raised to the power 3 by 2. In the question, we are given the radius of the ring equal to 1 meter. Charge on the ring Q is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 5 coulomb. Mass of the particle is equal to 0 0.9 into 10 raised to the power minus 3 kg. Charge on particle Q is equal to 10 raised to the power minus 6 coulomb. Therefore, the force acting on the negative charge Q will be F equal to Q into E. Hence, F equal to minus K into Q into Q divided by R square plus X square whole raised to the power 3 by 2 into X or M into A is equal to minus K into Q into Q divided by R square plus X square whole raised to the power 3 by 2 into X where A is the acceleration of the particle. So, A is equal to minus K into Q into Q divided by M into R square plus X square whole raised to the power 3 by 2 into X. Since X is negligibly small in comparison to R, therefore A is equal to minus K into Q into Q divided by M R cube into X. This is similar to the general equation of simple harmonic motion A equal to minus omega square into X. This implies that the motion of this particle is simple harmonic in nature. Comparing the above equations, we get omega square equal to K into Q into Q divided by M R Q. Or omega is equal to square root of K into Q into Q divided by M R Q. We know that time period is equal to 2 pi divided by angular frequency omega. On substituting the value of omega, we get time period equal to 2 pi into square root of m r cube divided by k into q into q. Substituting the given values of all variables, we get time period equal to 0.628 seconds. This concludes our video. Students must follow this methodology for solving similar problems by trying to derive the expression for acceleration of particle in the form A equal to minus omega square x. This will enable them in finding the time period and frequency of the oscillations. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. For more interesting and educational videos to earn while you learn, download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for studying.